Hello you beautiful people, I'm Steph and I'm going to show you how to make a naked egg. Now this is really really cool, it's a little trick from my book Incredible Edibles and after I've shown you what happens I'm going to explain why it's happened. Now what you need is this, you need an egg, just a normal normal egg and then you need some vinegar, this is some pickling vinegar but you can use any vinegar at all and then you need a non-metallic container, this is glass. Now you need non-metallic because Vinegar and metal, they don't like each other. They, you can tarnish it and it'll come out really horrible. So, all you need to do is take your egg, put it in your non-metallic container, and then add the vinegar. And when you add the vinegar, something amazing happens. Here we go. There's a chemical reaction going on in here already. Now, see all these tiny little bubbles forming around the top? Well, that is carbon dioxide. So, this is what happens. In the vinegar is something called acetic acid, and the acetic acid reacts together with the calcium carbonate, which is the hard shell of the egg. And they react and produce a couple of big things. One is calcium acetate, and the other is carbon dioxide. It's a byproduct of this reaction. And those bubbles are evidence of that reaction happening. Okay, so what you do is you leave it in there um, for about three days. I know, sorry, I should have mentioned that before. Three days, and hopefully all of the calcium carbonate will have dissolved. And then it will look like this. Yeah, it's a little bit murky. You can see lots of all this kind of muck everywhere here. But underneath here, after three days, the egg shell itself should have been eaten away. Now let's dig it out and have a look. Right, there we go. It's stuck a bit to the side of this. Here we go. Now, all of this eggshell on the outside has been dissolved. So if you start wiping it like that, you'll get all of it off. Now, I'm going to wash it off a bit and then just gently scrape away all of the shell itself. Eventually, you'll get nice and clean like that. Now, you can't really see that much, but this is your naked egg. If you get a nice powerful torch and hold it underneath the egg. Take a look at what happens. That is a naked egg. And what's happened is the outside shell has been dissolved away, but what's left behind is this thing called the semi permeable membrane. And if you've ever had an egg that's been overboiled, you take the shell off and you see there's a tiny little skin underneath and that's this amazing thing called the semi-permeable membrane so only some things can get through. So that's left behind and it holds the egg together but all the shell has dissolved. Now have a little look at this. It's bouncy. It's amazing. I could probably even bounce it off the board. Okay, you ready for this? Oh! <laughs> Try once more. Which just proves that it's a genuine egg underneath there. That is the semi-permeable membrane, and that is your naked egg. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, guys. I love playing with these crazy little tricks with food science, so come back and see some more.